Hey guys, I have you guys sitting up on like my makeup organizer, so I'm really hoping you guys don't fall. But I am getting ready. As you can tell, I have a huge crater pimple here. I think it's hormonal, but still no fun. Um, I'm getting ready today is Friday, April 12th. It is Bubba's fourth birthday. Him and I had a wonderful morning. Um, I woke Dennis up a little bit early for work today. And we gave him um, like a puppy ice cream, which I can clip a cl insert a clip here. Tomorrow's Bubba's birthday. Had to get prepared. So you guys can see how cute he was. I can't believe he's four. Literally insane. And today also marks um, the one year of Dennis and I owning this home, which is pretty awesome. And it's my brother or my sister and brother-in-law's fifth anniversary, which is just crazy because I feel like that all of those fell on the same day is kind of nuts. But um, today's a good day. But with that being said, I'm getting ready because I am heading over to my sister's house. I'm babysitting the boys tonight so then they can have like a date night. On their anniversary because I think that's important and I know with two kids it's hard to get that in and I hope one day when Dennis and I have babies it can be reciprocated so with that being said I'm getting ready um I don't want to do a lot of makeup but I wanted to like put something on that just to cover it up so today I've just been spending time with Bubba I went to the gym earlier and did that to get that out of the way and then yeah, that's all I have planned for this evening. Um, I don't know if you guys know, I don't know if I mentioned it in a vlog or not, but I am on Clomid. I started Clomid um, this period cycle. So the beginning, well, I guess the end of March kind of, I did day five, six, seven, eight, nine. What Clomid is, is it's a medicine that induces ovulation. Where I already ovulate, it's really good for people who don't ovulate where I already ovulate. So all it's going to do is release mature, good egg follicles to hopefully to, that something sticks and, you know, it increases your chance of twins, which is pretty awesome. I mean, I'll be happy with twins, triplets, singles, whatever. I would literally be happy with anything. Um, but that's kind of what it does for me. I did have some side effects. I was super emotional like super emo why taking it like I just cried over everything I don't really feel like that I was moody um in the sense of like being angry or rude towards people I don't think anything like that really happened to me sorry I'm gonna fill in my eyebrows but um definitely emotional I had severe cramping the first day I took it I was like oh my god this is awesome I have like no side effects like how cool is that well lo and behold day two through five it came in hot so um I had cramping and I had severe headaches like there was night times when I just had to lay in our bedroom with all the lights off no tv on like I'd play on my phone but my headaches were so bad I would say like migraine level and I don't really get those that often and I had it pretty much every day but once again if a little migraine and cramping causes me to have a baby I will do that any day of the week literally so that happened um, I'm still experiencing side effects I think from Clomid um like going to the gym has been really difficult because I've just been in pain like once I feel like my heart rate gets up and um, I start really exercising my side starts hurting so I've kind of been taking it easy and just doing more so like um, cardio and stuff like that, which is fine. Um, yeah, other than that, it's been pretty smooth sailing. Like I said, I've noticed that um, I've been getting days where I feel like my period's going to start sort of like those type of cramps. My bra is driving me insane today. But um, I had days where I felt like my period was going to start like that type of cramping. And then I had times where like my lower belly would get super hot like it felt like it was like on fire and then it would cramp so I don't know I think that's just a normal side effect too but like I said I will do this a thousand times if it will provide me with the baby so my period is due to start in like 11 days I think like 10 11 days so we'll see how that all goes Dennis and I did our part so hopefully the Clomid works for us and um if not I get one more month on it so Fingers crossed we don't have to do the one more month, but I'm going to finish getting ready because I can't multitask because when I'm sitting here, I just start talking to you guys 
and then I don't get ready and I have to leave in like a half an hour. So I'll take you guys along with me to see my nephews. I also wanted to show you guys, we got a new fridge yesterday. Sorry, our dishwasher is running, so if it's loud, I apologize. But we woke up the other day to our fridge not cooling, so we had to get a new one. In this spot, there's not a lot of room. So ideally, I would have loved to got like one of the freezer on bottoms or the side-by-side -side one, but it just was not ideal for the space. And right now also it opens from this side and in like three days they said that they'll come and change it to open up that way because that's the way it just flows with our kitchen. But I think it's so cute and it's all clean. Here's Bubba's treats that he got this morning, so cute. Um, it's so clean and nice looking. I'm just obsessed with it. I love it a lot. I'm gonna try my best to keep it clean and looking like this because this is just so satisfying. And now that we got this nice stainless steel, I'm like, mm, we need a new dishwasher. <laughs> we need a new stove. But obviously, we are not rushing to get anything like that because appliances are super expensive. And we said when we moved in, the only time we're gonna get an appliance is when they die. Other than that, we're gonna ride the wave with what we got. This works just fine. That works just fine. We did get a microwave. My mom bought us that for our housewarming gift. We got that for our shower, maybe. But, um, so yeah, that's the only reason why we bought that is because of the fact that it was dead and we needed a new one. There's the birthday boy. So I have been giving him two, like, you know what, Starbucks, how they do Puppuccinos, which is like whipped cream. I bought whipped cream for the boy and I put it in a solo cup and he loves it. I'll show you here and he loves it. <laughs> it's been his treat for his fourth birthday. And it's what they do at like Starbucks, how they just put that in a cup and call it a puppuccino or whatever. So I figured, hey, we can do that at home for him. He's so sweet. I can't believe he's four guys. Oh, wow, I'm so excited. <laughs> Yeah, they're booking it to make their reservation. No, she doesn't know. This way you have to move. This way or this way? Um, I don't know. I don't know which way it goes. So wet. Oh, here we gotta push this back down. There we go. Whoa, he's getting all wet. Now you shake him. Now you shake him. How does Papa, which way you gotta go? This way or this way? What do you see out there? Oh. You're so cute. You were sleeping when I first got here, but now you're awake. Hey guys, it's Saturday. Sorry I didn't really vlog much yesterday while babysitting. Um, as any of you know that actually have kids, uh, it's a handful and my dad and Aunt Bonnie came over for a little bit which was really nice the boys really enjoyed that and then Dennis got there when he was off of work too so I had a ton of help which was awesome and um it's always fun like I love watching Dennis with the boys they love him but anyways it's Saturday Bubba and I are outside chilling it's about like 56 degrees outside right now so it's really nice um it's a little windy so it's still a little cool but um, I have to start getting ready. I have a meeting with the people I'm gonna be working with. I don't know if I, I don't think I mentioned it, but I'm no longer with the credit union that I was with. I'm starting a new adventure, sorry. And um, I'm really excited. So I have a meeting with them at two, and I think it's like 12 now. So I have to start getting ready in just a little bit. And I'm really excited. Maybe I'll show you guys a little bit of the building that I'm gonna be working in because it's super pretty and new, so I'm excited. But um, yeah, I just wanted to check in with you guys and I'll catch up in a little bit. Same spot again. I am getting ready for my meeting that I told you guys about a little bit earlier. I've had a super emotional day today and I don't know what's going on, but like my mom called, I cried. My Aunt Bonnie sent me a really sweet text about how like um I did good babysitting the boys, cried again, <laughs> text Dennis. I was like, I don't know what's happening but I'm super emo. So I'm getting ready. Um, I already have my makeup on. I use my Naked 3 palette. I've been really into this lately. Um, it's super like pretty rose gold colors, 
which you guys have probably seen this a thousand times, but um, I've really been enjoying that. And then the foundation I'm using today is my Sonia Kashuk, which matches how tan I am right now because I have been tanning at the gym. So sorry about this here. But um, and then now I'm just using my butter bronzer, which smells divine. So I have to run before I go um before I go to my meeting, I have to run and mail a few things. And it's so funny because we have a mailbox, like we have a home that can probably mail stuff out. But for some reason, our mailbox, like I've left something in there to be mailed out before. And I went and checked on it and it was still there after the mail ran. So I don't know if I did something wrong or what. But for me, it's just easier to um bring it to the mailbox. Like we have a mailbox, um, like a standalone mailbox really close to our house. So I'm just going to go and do that really quick. I didn't wash my hair. So this is my hair from yesterday. I just curled it to put some like flavor to it. So now I have to do highlights. I'm either going to do crown of my canopy or precious petals, both from wet and wild. I think I'm gonna do this guy today. I also love my Mac Soft and Gentle. That's another staple that I use all the time. If you hear Bubba, he's going crazy. So, I'm gonna do a little bit of this, and then I gotta put my mascara on, brush my teeth, and then I will be good to go. And I am wearing the same shirt I wore on my birthday. But I'm obsessed with it. It's so comfortable. So I figured, why not? And it's nice outside. So it's like a perfect day to wear it. So I'm going to finish getting ready and I'll talk to you guys in a bit. So I'm all done with my meeting. And um, my friend bought a house in the city where my meeting was. So I text her and I was like, hey, are you home? I want to see your house. So it worked out perfect. Um, she was actually at like a graduation party. No, an open. I don't know. She was somewhere. But she is heading home now. So I told her I'll meet her there so I can go inside and see the new house and stuff. Um, they've had it since, I can't remember when they signed on it, like the end of March maybe. Um, but they're just now like living there and tonight's going to be their first night. So I'm so excited to go in and just take a look. The meeting went really, really well. Um, a lot of new possibilities and stuff in my future. So I'm excited. But I'm going to wait for Megan to get home so I can go in and see her cute house. They're getting a puppy soon. It's so sweet. They lived in an apartment where they couldn't have dogs. And all they wanted was a freaking puppy. So, um, they are lined up to get a puppy. So, oh my god, I'm so excited. They don't have him yet, but they're going to be getting him, I think, in the next couple of weeks. I can't wait to love on him, too. But anyways, I'm just going to sit here and wait. There's so many, like, squirrels and stuff that are running around that are catching my eye. Um, so sorry that I seem like distracted, but, um, I'm just going to sit here and wait for them to get home. Told you there's squirrels everywhere. This one's just going to town. He's so cute though. Home from running around. Now I'm backyard with Bubba's. I was going to kick the soccer ball. I have Dennis's shoes on because they're by our back door and they're comfy. So Bubba, you want to play the soccer ball? He loves the soccer ball. Ready? Go get it. <laughs> He's the best. Are you ready? <laughs> He's so cute. Good boy. <laughs> so it's about 5.30 and I'm still just not feeling good. Like my stomach is super upset. So I was trying to get myself motivated to go to the gym. I took all my makeup off, put my hair up, got on like... A sweater to get myself motivated and I'm just not so instead I'll take Bubba for a walk we'll go for a walk <laughs> I figured at least I'm getting exercise and he's getting exercise and it's perfect I think I'm gonna call it a night. I took this little guy in a walk and now I'm just relaxing. 
Um, I was watching some YouTube, but I don't think I'm going to be doing anything for the rest of the night. Dennis actually works till 8, so he'll be off in about an hour and a half and home in about two and a half hours, roughly. But um, I'm going to take it easy. I think I'm going to make tacos for dinner tonight, which sound delicious. I hate when he works late because then we eat late. I feel bad making food and eating without him and then him coming home and eating by himself I always feel bad so I usually try to wait for him so that's what I'm gonna do but thanks for hanging out with me these last couple of days and celebrating Bubba's birthday with us can't believe our boy is four crazy how time flies <coughs> hey <coughs> sorry guys I had to pause you for a second because a dog walked by so Guard dog Bubba obviously had to make sure we were okay and safe, so he was barking. But anyways, thanks for hanging out with me, and I will talk to you guys soon. Bye.